tokens, Rodrigo 0x99. Slash user Rodrigo 0x99. 194 messages in chat following for a couple years. It was a typo, I swear. Where's the button that says turn this person into a suspicious user? But in some ways, like being a suspicious user is actually a benefit because it means all your messages get highlighted for me. So I, I opted not to do it. But I thought about it. I thought about it. Not a not a huge fan of this team, but it's round one. Who cares? Be an overpriced smartphone, or as I call them, uh, all of them. <laughs> no, really. I mean, it's. I'm not saying they're cheap, but considering it's a device you use, you know, every day, for. So, really woven its way into the fabric of our daily existence. I don't necessarily, I mean, there's worse values, I think. You could definitely say there's worse values. Some of that. I'm not trying to offend the, the phone users in the chat. Double mosquito. Yeah, like, I don't have, uh... I don't have buyer's remorse on my smartphone the way I have buyer's remorse on my HTC Vive, my Gen 1 HTC Vive. You think I don't remember you, HGHTRHGJBZT? This is the same person who ran that German Shepherd, Shepherd build. You want to become the Billy Billy XP this week? Be careful what you wish for. I haven't seen Billy Billy in a while. Have you? Really makes you think. Okay, give me my level. Don't care for that unit, honestly. Is he all right? I wouldn't know. I haven't, I haven't seen him in a while. There's not, nothing untowards happened. I just... That hurt. Just genuinely, I, I hope they're okay. All I'm going to say is it is a little suspicious that when Billy Billy stopped playing, Empty the Cup also stopped playing. Just, uh, you've been acting pretty sus lately. It's like Magpie Puppy. Someone in chat said it. It isn't smart, but it feels smart. I think I'm, I'm, I'm tempted to just go puppy next round again. This hero beetle's kind of, it's kind of doing something. Getting kind of sick with it. I am going to say, sell me, purchase me, sell me. Well, you know what? Start with the, the moth sell, maybe. Sell me, purchase me, salad me, unless you get a magpie on one of your... Oh, actually, probably dolphin here, or pineapple on dolphin, I should say. Then roll, keep a, sal I'll keep a salad. Eh, I don't like these units that enough to keep a... Well, sure, let's do it. I got one gold like a fool. Why was I on one? I did one extra reroll for no reason. What was I thinking? Yes. Honestly, too big brain for me. You were supposed to hit a puppy. Oh, Magpie went first and took my gold. Oh, that's my... Okay, I see. I'm not even worried. I think people are, like, fixating on the fact that it made the puppy not scale. The what, My other question is, like, why is it any good at all? Like, even if, it, if that hadn't been the problem, what does it accomplish? 
Okay, sell my heroic beetle. I'm going to move a puppy up. I'm going to give us some garlic. I am going to add a silver fox to the front, though. And I'm going to roll once. I don't think we're... We don't have the scalers to make a silver fox work longer term. But we'll probably... I don't know. We'll figure it the fuck out. You actually get to use the two extra gold next turn. Well, yeah, but then you also have to not spend down to zero. So you don't really get the two extra gold. Because you have to stop at two gold on the next turn. You have to do that anyway with the puppy? <laughs> okay, no, you're right. You're right. You get 12 gold. The first turn, you spend 8. Next, from every subsequent turn, you get 10. Well, you get 12, but you can spend 10. Yeah, okay, that makes... I see it. Yeah, you know, I, now, at this point, I wish we had stuck with it. We're probably dead, though. Uh, I'm gonna. Well, are we gonna use? I don't. Uh, um. Okay. Try this. This is. Uh, we're, we're. We're. I mean, because we're on lethal. That's why I'm buying this second pineapple. Just so you know. Oh, but then we don't get a puppy scaling. You piece of shit. Ah! Hang on. Hang. Hang on. Oh, dude. Look at this. Look at this extra gold we're getting. Don't pay attention to the mistake. Just focus on the excess gold. Now that's crazy. 13 gold. Okay, you absolutely have to scale. At this point, you probably go. Dude, I don't know. Let's try it. I think you roll both of the dolphins. I'm tempted to take a llama, but I, I think it might just be a little too late for the llama. That situation obviously changes things somewhat. Remember, you got to save two gold. I mean, this is... There's a little hopium involved. Let's put it that way. Save me right here. Yeah, this seems bad. I think we're super dead. <laughs> no shot. <laughs> it's the lack of scale. The scaling mistakes we made early definitely cost us on that one. We did get a lot of gold, though, to roll over for the next, uh, the next attempt. Okay. I don't like this team. But you gotta play to, to what you get in your shop. You be like a fizzy fry. Who's frying chicken in here? OMG, me. I can complain about a lot of things. I really can't complain about the matches that we've gotten in the in the shops. Like we've we've had like a level two and a half so many times. By by round three, which is kind of crazy. Level me. Toad, crazy unit. For the time being. You know what? No, stack. Give me one big Marty. I'm not worried about the double level up. Much. Moth me. I think this will be the best value out of what we got available, but we'll see. It's a slightly stronger boy. That's that's very unfortunate for me. A slightly stronger boy. If 
I could scale you. If I could scale you. You know what? Come out here. I'm going to do a slight change of pace. This should be enough. You'll, have, you'll be a 5-5. Five, five. I'm going to put another honey out here. I know it's getting a little, a little crazy, but... This time, this time I have the stronger boy. This time I have the stronger boy! Slight change of pace. Is that an early 2000s groove band? Are you talking about um, Soul Decision? Kinda faded, but it's feeling alright. Think about making my move tonight. What's, wait, Soul Decision... They have faded. They also have... Is VIP Daniel here? Ooh, it's kind of crazy. Ooh, it's kind of crazy. I've been thinking maybe. Gotta get you off of my mind. First you say you want me. Then you something broly. If you want my love. Anyway, you need to get pilled. But we need something that's actually like good. Something that deserves it. Something like that. Starfish, I mean, realistically, you will probably see, like, a Starfish um, team at some point beat my ass, but I think that it is not reliable this week. Okay, there's a level, at least, there's some garlic. Don't forget, let's do it right. That hurt. I don't think I know let's do it right. I know Let's Get Loud by Jennifer Lopez, though. Greatest honey of all time. Ideally, I'm going to wait for the... <laughs> Just about to say I'm going to wait for the level up. I'm still going to wait for the level up. My precious... This might be the run, because we have no scaling so far. This might be the run where you have to try a Doberman. Let me see what happens when it levels up. I don't think I've ever purchased one. So it doesn't give you extra coconuts on subsequent attacks, but it does give you a much bigger buff. Delightfully devilish, Seymour. Here's the thing. You're going to be like, why sell the peacock? I'd like to buy the Doberman just to save us the gold next turn rather than just wasting rerolls. And the peacock is not going to level because we have to sell our whole squad. The, Do the Doberman has to be our lowest tier unit. So we, I feel like doing it now makes the most sense. This is where, like, a banana into a pill would really hit the spot. Oh, we knew that was coming. This one. Oh, baby! <laughs> it's the luckiest draw of all time. Now, please give me a monkey. Wait, no matter what, we know we have to, we have to start on winding. So I think you start here, and then honestly, we might. there's no better time to sell the moth and the chinchilla. Because we have the space to get the gold out of it. So we might as well sell, 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 sell. I guess we, you know what, now I'm thinking, level it up so we get another tier 5. And no matter what it is, just pop it on the squad. Oh, he's crazy, he's crazy. Sell me. I think you I think you probably sell your toad too, just to get the first activation on the Doberman. Why not, man? And then we're buffing the Doberman, buying the seal, buying some garlic. Let's not be too picky. Let's add a cupcake to our seal to get some permanent stats too. And maybe this will hit the seal. 
let's go. I, I honestly, it's a it's a bit crazy, but we're trying. Is a huge coconut. There's no doubt about that. Holy cow, it worked right off the pivot. I don't believe it. <laughs> that should be our worst turn. But we get, we still got to get a tier 5. I don't know how that's going to happen. So here's what we're going to do. We can't add another tier 4. They'll, they'll screw each other up. I think you just buy the foods that you see. That's very nice. I appreciate that. Still keep you around. We got chocolate coming. So I think one salad frozen makes the most sense. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's definitely, it's a harder cook than, than typical. My God, we won that one too. That's hard to believe. Now, we need tier fives. I don't think you, ha you're, you can afford to be too picky. <laughs> I think maybe you just throw you onto the team. Hear me out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really care what you spit out. I, I, like, the 1-1 one, one buff in the seal is, is fine. But to get two units out of this definitely interests me more. And then we could also pill the beluga to get another monkey if we, if we thought it was apropos. Don't you motherfucking steal my coconut, you piece of crap. You, you piece of shit! I lose, uh, obviously, to... Well, we won anyway, but... Any raccoons, it's on site. At this point, I don't think we need to take a goat just to take a goat. Like... I think we can afford to roll a little bit. Goat is goaded? No, not really. Goat seal? Goat doesn't... Why, why, why does goat and seal have a bonus together? They don't. Goat monkey pill? What is that even... <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying things. It's a free monkey? What are you talking about it's a free monkey? We don't have we don't have a pill. It would be a free monkey as if there's a monkey in the shop. Then we would but then that would still cost us three gold. What we have is a goat that costs three gold and then three more gold to put a banana on it and then one more. We don't even have to, you don't even know what you're talking about, okay? Don't worry about it. We'll, we'll pill the beluga if we have to, but for now. the thinking man's engagement here. Here's the way I think we play it. I think we buff the seal by the beluga and then we hope that the back beluga gets the salad. Oh! <laughs> oh, yeah! So we're, we're spawning a bunch of units that we have no reason to be spawning. And then we can still get the level 2 Beluga. I don't care what gets spat out at all. No! Whatever. It's not that big of a deal. <laughs> Holy cow. It's true that there are, there are many squads this week. We're basically like one big unit at the front and then scalers at the back. The coconut goes crazy. I would love a beluga that spits out a reindeer. I don't want to overwrite your banana, though. <laughs> so I'm like... I, th I think we like blueberry... I don't know if there's a way to do this. I'm like, I, okay, I think you have to, I want you to spit out a reindeer. So no matter what, let's, 
garlic meat. And then we can always drag you on top of you, which should keep the reindeer and the... And the garlic. To lose the banana would suck, but... Okay, let a man think for a second. I think here... You actually do better with a level... Two... Oh, but if we make the beluga eat... The chocolate. Oh, dude, I got it. Hang on, hang on. This He's pausing? He's pausing. You level the Doberman naturally. Dude, maybe you just let... Maybe you just combine your belugas and then put out a level 2 reindeer next turn instead of worrying about creating a level 2 reindeer out of a level 2 beluga. I think this, this seal is getting outclassed right now. Nice squad. <laughs> Value? I mean, you're sticking. Just give me a second here. So we gotta... You gotta go like that. And you should have a reindeer. That's perfect. Okay. Then, I'm just stacking you out here. And then, my word, these shops have been, have been absurd. I actually feel like the reindeer would benefit more from the buffs. But the thing is, I don't want to put it at the front right now because I think it gets blown out by a big Marty. So I think having it at, see right now it would have, maybe it wouldn't have died, but it would have come close. I think it actually will do better at like chunking through scalers like this. Yeah, like look at it. We, we won for one their big scaler. This is the, it's the way to do it, man. Then you'll spit out a level two reindeer. Holy bursh. Honestly, the seal is, is outclassed. I think you buff your... Monkey, unless you get the chance to get a level 2 reindeer instead. Is actually just insane value. Look at this. Okay, that's that's a very strong beluga. But it didn't spit anything out. Oops. <laughs> Dude, this is crazy. This team is insane. Buy me? Roll me? Buy me. It is tempting, but I don't want you to spit out a level 3 llama. I want you to spit out a level 3 reindeer. I think, honestly, for now... Well, you know, you could always just chocolate a monkey. And then be okay with that. Like, just blowing out their big unit is so freaking good. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You really thought you had something! Now that was a team. And you know what? Obviously, you, you owe a lot of that to the Doberman and the most incredible shops of all time. You also owe a surprising amount to a level 3 chinchilla. Because that is... Uh, that's what kicked off the, the pivot. Ooh. I don't think Doberman can work on, on every squad, but it definitely... It worked on that squad, that's for sure. Okay. It's not that bad. That's one for the ages. That, that was a very fun sap run. I had a great time. How about it, like an ordinary investor? You guys ever think about how crazy it is that ordinary investors can get incredible returns? I mean, sorry, that's not how you phrase it. <laughs> how ordinary investors can get extraordinary returns? That's what I meant to say. Would have sounded a little bit more elegant. Keeps me up at night? Not me. Sleep like a baby. 
three groundhogs? What have I done to deserve this? Scoliosis King. <laughs> No, we need the level early. Because we want to see if the unit that we get off the level is what we're going to be buffing with the otter. It's no good. I've been scammed. I think I want my money back. Are the allegations true that you bopped to the Arkells? I did um, when I saw them at Hillside like 2000 and... Must have been Hillside 2009. But then something happened. Because like... Uh, in 2000... In Valentine. Thanks for the gifted subscriptions, by the way. Thank you. In 2009, the Arkells were kind of like... Um, they were like a bar bands, like semi indie rock sort of sort of joint. And, so, and then I went to Korea and I came back and they were like the most boring um, CBC like a, a anointed band that played like every single Canadian television live event. New Year's Eve, Canada Day, Hockey Day in Canada, like. Every single event has the Arkells playing like these boring ass, like um, like Our Lady Peace past the 1990s type songs, and uh, I just I don't know why I I think they they did do a Canadian sellout and I'm not mad I'm not mad because I get I give them the respect, but they kind of went from being I don't know I saw them as like a Canadian. Not not quite at the same level, but like a Canada Canada's version of the Hold Steady, and then instead they opted to become like Canada's Kings of Leon, which is fine. That's me every time I play uh, Super Auto Pets. I'm just farming content basically, but yeah. See that I like that. Why listen to the Arkells when you could listen to Sam Roberts? Sam Roberts kind of. He he kept it uh, he kept it sort of weird. Some of his songs are radio friendly, some of them not so much. But I, I feel like he stayed true to true to the Sam Roberts brand the whole time. Also, Brother Down got to be like one of the best what, all time great songs to watch Fruitopia commercials to. It's only round five. We're doing great. Don't cry yet. We bought this to sell it. Sell me. Add a toad because the toad is good. We do want to take a level. Before we take a level, we should buff some units who are sticking around. It's probably you two. Speaking of bands that sold out but made great music at one point. You're taking a buff. I'm not huge on the rooster this week, but it's hard to argue with one showing up on the level up. Okay. And garlic is just... I mean, I'm of the opinion that basically if you don't have a garlic on your team, you probably can't get to 10, but... Can you sing Clumsy by Our Lady Peace? I could. I'm not gonna, but I could. When it comes to Our Lady Peace, I'm, I'm not a clumsy guy. I also. I'm, a, I'm more of a... A star scream sort of guy, like a yay, 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 yay. More of like, uh, and even a lot, I'm still down with Our Lady Peace all the way through to happiness is not a fish that you can catch. One man army goes kind of crazy. Is anybody home goes kind of crazy. It's when they, they did, um, I forget what the album was called. But they did, um, in, was it something machines, fragile machines, pretty hate machine, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. They got a little too, like their songs got too um, aspirational for me. Which is fine, again, more power to them. It's probably the, the Kreviazuk um, influence in so many ways, such as 
Am I really keeping a fish here? I, I guess I'm keeping a fish. Why would you keep the otter? <laughs> okay, we probably gotta, we're gonna sell this otter for something that provides literally anything that's valuable. We could roll a dolphin for one round. I'm willing. Really need a level three. Oh, that's a good toucan. That's a, that's a smart hit right there. I don't think we're screwed though. Oh, we, we drew. We're definitely not screwed. Don't insult Krevi Asuk. She had a lot of top 10 songs as a writer. Well, I didn't know that, okay? Thank you for informing me. I think you can make orangutan work this week, but I, I think you can already tell what kind of track I'm on right now. It looks a little bit like this. It looks like a little pill banana. Try to make a big rooster, then we'll move it back later. I was it, it, very um, fortuitous timing with our conversation today. I was listening to Our Lady Peace in my car yesterday. Okay, 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 I'll take my draw. Definitely I'll take a level, even though it's early. Seal, I mean, we, we saw what Seal could do for us last time, and, and honestly, I'm not, a, I'm not a hater, but I'm not 100% sold. I lived. I did not live. Wait a minute. No, I did not live. <laughs> Steel was do Seal was doing well until you stopped using it. Well, why did I stop using it? Answer. Because I was uh, prioritizing better units. And we won with a 10-piece easily. It's one of the easiest 10-pieces of my entire life. Ergo, if, if the Seal can't be that good. Motherfucker said, air go. <laughs> I think you could freeze a, a banana. I don't know who you're putting it on, but you could freeze it. I don't think this is going. I think we got some issues. Maybe a little lucky on that one. But it's, it's luck I'll happily take. Cobra can be pretty good. I mean, the thing is, like, the Dragonfly is generating one gold a turn. But, like, fucking, and, like, oh, it's generating 3-3 three, three in buffs. It's fucking nothing. Put, like, a Cobra out here instead. We could at least get some sauce off of it. And then, I mean, I, I hate to be this guy, I would absolutely pill the cobra to just get another monkey, unless we get a level two cobra or something like that. Because we could always replace this cobra with another cobra. I think maximizing our odds of getting monkeys makes a, a big difference right now. Wow, it kind of worked. Three three buff on everybody. <laughs> it's it's pretty good. The problem I have right now is if we get a level two rooster, we have to put our reindeer at the front. Wait, what? If we get a level two rooster, we have to put our fish at the front. Because, like, Rooster will be missing a chick. 
Cobra does better when it's behind units. Monkey, I mean, you could do a self a self buffing monkey, I suppose. Toad obviously doesn't work at the front. So you could sell fish by reindeer. It's true. The thing that bothers me about it is that I think that most teams, and we saw this last time, most teams are going to be rolling a unit at the front that will probably be able to kill our level one reindeer through its melon armor, which scares me. But we do, you're right, we do have three HP, so I think maybe you could... Well, you might as well start with this and just see what you get. That doesn't really change things for us. This is fine. You could run... I mean, the monkey's not going anywhere. Neither is the toad, to be fair. But you could run stake on a monkey. Just maximize your... Maximize your, your curve right now, I suppose. Okay. It didn't kill us. This seal is gonna go crazy on us, for sure. Okay, if not the seal, then the reindeer is gonna go crazy on us. We drew! <laughs> Roll me. I'll take a pizza on this one. We, 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 rooster needs the buffs, reindeer really needs the buffs. We need another monkey, man. I lived. Briefly. Briefly, I lived. Toad is really, like, it's the, it's the bell of the ball right now. Please shoot the llama. I don't think it matters. We win either way. Okay. Eked one out. Snake needs the buffs. I think Snake, for now, is just happy to be there. I'm going to be honest. The thing is, though, I'm not pilling a Snake to make a level 2 monkey. I think that the Snake, it, he's, he's earned his right to stay on the team. And that's not something I would have said recently. Or until recently. You could put a lemon on a rooster. You're going to want it at some point. Okay. It is what it is. I'm stunned that our... Um Wow, that was... A, a, oh, never mind, you got screwed. <laughs> I'm, I'm stunned that our reindeer has not uh, fizzled yet. We did it again, dude! Okay, you need the buff, in my opinion. You know what? You've earned it. Unless we get chocolate or a, or a double. Well, we'll freeze that too, so we're not going to get chocolate. You'll, we'll get you next round. You've earned it. You've, you've proven... You, I, I put you on a bridge deal. Two years, $4.5 million. I said, show me what you're worth. You became one of the... Oh, wow, big sloth! You became one of the top two-way centers in the NHL. There you go. That's so you, You've earned it. You've earned it. Big sloth. Big sloth. Big sloth. You, congratulations. On lethal, well, it's not really the way the multiplayer works, but I got to give you props either way. These are your props. Okay, still got two life. Team's a little underscaled. We were hoping to get maybe, you know, some chocolate at some point. That's okay. Life comes at you slow sometimes. Level two, turtle. Rest of my squad's a little, a little sussy. Close, but no cigar. I need chocolates here. Come on. A little insulting. A little insulting. It's very good. I'm going to take it, but my heart did say roll for more chocolate to see if or a, a, a monkey would have been... I think I'm happy with this.
I think I'm okay with the way that went down. Oh no! <laughs> Never mind, my my whole squad! Okay, well that's just a smart team right there. That's a nice hit. We only got seven. Catfish cow, huh? Okay, let's play some dark and darker. Slash marker.